What's up, guys? Todd Penn here, if you don't know me. Uh, gonna be a weird video. I'm 48 years old. Uh, no, 49 years old. Just turned 49 last April 3rd. I'm a double amputee. Lost both my legs in 2019 to vascular disease. I was a UPS truck driver before that. Single, uh, just working, having my daughter on the weekends. And uh, 2019 changed my life drastically. Um, Cause now I just live a life uh, with health issues now, and my stumps bother me, and need one of them cut off, and uh, I had to give up on the prosthetics because I need a back surgery, and uh, came up with an idea to make a bus to travel the country for a year, and here it's been two and a half years I've had it, and I have my daughter is getting her license, going to be driving, so I had to get her something, and. Um, I wanted to be a part of that. I didn't want her mom to just go do that like she does everything because she's the one that makes the money now. And um, so I tried to be a part of that and got her the Jeep, the 2011 Rubicon, and uh, just fixed it up for her, made it really nice. Asked her, do you like this? Do you like that? You know, what kind of bumpers you want? And she, you know, picked everything. Most For the most part, she built that. She picked it out. Uh, some of the stuff I just did on my own, knowing what she needed, like for the lift kit and stuff. But um, she wanted the lift kit. She asked for it. Um, it might be crazy or people think I'm spoiling her, but, you know, I might be. But she's a good kid. She gets good grades. She works. She does the horse uh, show and stuff. She's a very responsible kid. Um, so I don't have a problem with it. And I only have one kid. I only get to do this one time. This is my uh, – I don't want this – I didn't want to pass this by. Um, I'll worry about getting my bus done after I get my finances right and pay off the credit card I used to buy all that stuff for a Jeep. Um, and I'll get, I'll eventually hit the road. Um, I'll hopefully get my YouTube channel going. Uh, I mean, it takes one video, one viral video of something to happen where you get 50 grand, 80 grand. And, uh, I'd go buy me a damn bus with a, a lift on it already. That's like a motorhome bus and be traveling with that right now, living that. And I'd be able to start my content, get my content going and me driving around and, uh, maybe I hit another uh, lucky video and get $100,000 or, you know, something out of that video. And then I, sh I mean, the, what I plan on doing with my channel eventually, if I can get it like that, is I'll drive around. And I'll, I'll Like the people that help me get to where I'm at, I'll make video and content off of buying them stuff for helping me get to where I'm at, doing what, you know, what they did to, to help me out, to help this dream happen. Like, you know, like Mike, he's really gone out of his way and done so much for me on this bus and this Jeep build for my daughter. Um, that's, you know, the first person I'll take care of. Uh, he needs a new dolly. And uh, I would love to be able to go surprise him with the dolly for doing all that he did for me to get me on the road so I can get my videos going, get my content going, and get my channel going, showing that, you know, a double amputee that was a UPS driver that lost everything he had, and he's stuck in a chair. Got my dog. Hi, Chloe. You know, trying to live a normal life and be happy, trying to be positive all the time. It's really, really hard. I struggle with it. Trust me. Um, that's why my channel's the way it is. And I haven't been steady with content. And I haven't really gotten anywhere. But it's just hard going from making good money to on a very tight budget. I'm retired. Basically, I'm 49 years old. I'm retired. And I got to wait till I'm 55 to get uh, a little bit more money. And um, that's where I'm at in life. That's uh, what I got going on. And it's I struggle. I, I've been, you know, like the last eight months since I had health issues, something happened to where I, I uh, had a medic, medication switch, and it really screwed me up. And I had to go to the hospital over that. And ever since then, I've kind of lost my oomph. That's what I tell everybody. It did something to me. I didn't have a stroke or anything, but it just did something to me to where I, it's like I lost all my interest or drive to do anything. But I'm trying to get it going. I'm trying to get this GoPro figured out. I'm getting better at it so I can get back into practicing all my editing. And I subscribed or I upgraded my GoPro subscription because I had to renew it and got one that gives me better editing uh, tools uh, to use once I figure them out. <laughs> and I still got that Sony camera I got when they had that, that Prime deal that Joe, the guy, he posts a lot of video, Joe Sykes, he's a Kenmore kid. He posts a lot of videos, uh, and he's funny. And uh, I seen him post about this camera, and I thought, man, I want to get a better camera than my GoPro. And this was on sale, and I bought it. 
and I got all the extras. It was like, I get suckered in on all that crap. But I gotta learn how to use this thing and learn how to get the videos off of this onto my computer, which I'm starting to figure out I need a new laptop because it won't work unless it's plugged in now, so that's not good. And that thing's only a couple, like three years old. But I'm gonna figure out this camera and get try to get things going and, and show more steady content of just my life. Because that's what the double amputees and other amputees and people that I talk to a lot on my channel, um, which is why I started it, because I was watching people see what their life was like. I didn't care what they were doing. And that kind of gave me hope and gave me like, well, that's not, not going to be that bad. You know, I can do something. Um, but that's what I got going on, guys, in my life lately. And... Uh, and like I said, I'm trying to be positive all the time. I'm not, I don't like putting negative. If I'd rather post nothing than you get on here being negative, being a little you know, sad Sally or whatever you want to call it. But, um, hold on here. Going out to the shop. But, um, yes. This is where I hang out all the time, out in my shop. I sell them wheels. Those are the wheels that were on her Jeep. Gotta fix this chair. This is my second chair. I, I go between two chairs. And that one took a crap on me. I left it out in the rain. Covered up. And something got wet. But I think I know what it is. Gotta dry it out. But eventually I'm gonna get that bus done or something good will happen to me and I'll get a bigger bus that, you know, it's more homely and I can get my chair in and travel around. I don't know what the hell I'm gonna do. Something's gonna happen. I'm so d determined to do this one year road trip, showing a double amputee, surviving, having fun, living a life, trying to, you know, show everybody on my YouTube what I got, you know, where I'm at, what, where I'm going, what I'm doing, what happened. Uh, you know, go down to Freedom Factory, to Cletus McFarlane has that track down there. We're whistling Diesel and Heavy D and all them guys. Um, Vice Creek Garage, all them other YouTubers that I follow go there and they race and it's just such cool stuff they do there. And now Cletus is into helicopters and flying. It's just uh, a lot of fun down there and I want to go down there sometime. I'd like to be able to drive down there on my bus, have a place to stay at one of their events and meet people and, and book, put stuff on my YouTube there showing where I'm at, Freedom Factory. You know, instead of being stuck here in Barberton, a dog made for tea, like, boo-hoo, my life sucks. You know, I don't have anything to do. My life's over. I'm not like that. I'm close. Say we ain't like that. Right? We're not like that. Yeah. So... I'm just trying to keep get, get myself going and get, getting to be push myself more to uh, be more steady with my content and my even though it's nothing special what I'm doing to show my day to day life as a double amputee on how what I do to keep happy what I do to get around how I get around how I you know how I get how I do things. It's raining here in Ohio, guys. Gotta love it. Gotta love it. There's my trailer I got last year. It's still behind my bus. It's like my shop inside. Uh, there's my daughter's Jeep. So you can't see very well. It's badass. Let's see here. Let's see. Battery's dead. You get the point. I gotta probably hook the wires that come loose or something. But um, this is the tow behind my bus, so I've got stuff to fix my chairs when they break. Keep my extra chair in there. And there's the penthouse. Maybe that's not the one, and something happens where I get something bigger and better. Who knows what's gonna happen? You never know. But I'm gonna make something happen. This Jeep is murdered out. You can't see anything in the night. Looks good, though. I wish you could see it. Yep. Let's see if I can fit my fat butt through here. Sorry, guys. I'm going back inside. 
I made it. But, um, I just wanted to make a short video. I'm, I'm, uh, I just felt like talking. I just felt like making a video and updating you guys, the guys, the, the people that care, the people that want to see this, want to see where I'm going to go, the people that want to see me succeed or watch me succeed because I am. I'm 49 year old double amputee that was working my butt off driving truck for UPS. I like driving. So I'm going to try to continue driving my bus and, and try to live off my income and live a happy life and meet a lot of cool people. So I love you guys. Peace.